Folks, uh, Carl here from the AEC forum, Richo71 is the avatar. Uh, this is my first time at doing a, a vlog or a video vlog of what I've done on my channel. Uh, it's not going to be a weekly thing because I don't I don't review as, as frequently as some of the reviewers on there because most of the stuff I review, it's what I've bought personally and I don't buy stuff every week so it's just going to be a, something I slot in on the channel now and again. I've got me Tassimo here. Let me just have a quick drink. Oh, lovely latte, macchiato. Uh, I'm going to just tell you about a couple of things that I bought uh, that I've got coming up uh, and how things have gone since my last couple of reviews on with the devices I'm using so far, or the atomizers I'm using so far. I've just made some couple of juices up. Uh, Glass bottles, orange, uh, that's an LT uh, orange concentrate with their VPG 50 50 stuff. And then, I don't know how this one's going to turn out, but I've mixed orange and maple syrup together. So, uh, I like my fruits. Uh, recently reviewed the Mega Tank from Kangi, uh, still using that on my Semivore and the vision spin is still going strong and I'll take that out and about we have got the aero tank on there at the moment that's it with the aero tank on uh, quick vape on it these aero tanks do keep up I've said it before uh, they keep up with vaping, that's uh, set around about 4.1 volts on the on the spinner, on the dial. And uh, the two ohm dual coil heads in there. And them air tanks do really do keep up very well. Uh, very surprised at them. Good flavour out of them as well. Uh, what I've got coming up. Uh, I bought a... Uh, just check it on the web from Matt at M Vapes. I bought a, a TOBH rebuildable dripping atomizer. Love the look of it. Uh, the pictures on Matt's website are really good as well. Of it, uh, $12.95 as well. Free shipping. Bit of a no brainer, really, uh, from what I've heard from the atomizer itself, from the dripping at itself. Uh, coil it as many ways, you know, different ways as you want. Uh, so yeah, that's coming. That should be in on Monday. That actually, I ordered it Friday, and he said, and he he posts out Saturday. So, and um, also from a guy local to me, uh, who's got a shop that people use on the forum, One Stop Mod Shop. Uh, his location is Stoke on Trent. Wee, uh, John. Has got in touch with me through the PMs uh, with regards to. I asked him a while back about to uh, getting the black stingray, the copper black uh, from Infinite, and he's got a few coming. Uh, should have been here Friday, but there's a bit. He PM me. He PM me on uh, Friday saying the slight delay on the order, so it'd be a Saturday, which was today, which it isn't. He hasn't PM'd me again yet anyway, or Monday, uh, but hey up John, nice to see you mate, uh, waiting on it still, still waiting on a PM, he PM'd me now, even though we haven't seen the video yet, uh, so yeah I've got that coming, the infinite one, there's been a lot of, I mean obviously fast tech sell them and quite a few people have sold them, uh, the 26651 uh, as well, uh, I've see I've seen that, but I don't I've seen reviews of that on e on YouTube. I'm not liking that at all. That one. Uh, so it's a, it's a, the twenty six six fifty Stingrays are a bit different kind of setup, and uh, not not the kind of setup I like. Uh, so yeah, the other Stingray black copper Stingrays that people have been getting, some of them you know, the quality hasn't been that good. Uh, the infinite one supposed to be the better one. Uh, 
the manufacturers. Uh, nice gift box with it as well. All gift boxed up. Uh, so yeah, I've got that coming. I haven't paid for that yet, by the way. Uh, John's done me a good deal on that. But uh, I'm wait, wait, still waiting for him to PM me. Uh, I've also, uh, I'm still looking at my PMs now. Uh, but, 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 but. Vapor Z, I did it. I did it. Sort of an inventory for them not not so long ago with regards to uh, pricing and stuff, and they've kept in touch. Uh, they sent me some juices for for doing that for them, and uh, they got in touch with me with regards to their new uh, juices that are coming out from them, and Tan got in touch with me. Uh, UK. I'm just checking now. I'm just checking all the PMs I've got off him. Yeah, they're doing a lot of flavours in this uh, new juice. I think it's, it is for sale now. Uh, uh, another company are uh, producing these for them, and they've they've tweaked it between the salves and. Uh, I've got some juices for coming from them uh, for review. I don't do juice reviews normally. Uh, I've got they sending me out. I don't know three or four probably. Uh, they asked me to pick some, so I picked three. Uh, the, the ones I picked was Absolute Aniseed, Outrageous Orange, and Coolio Mint. Uh, whether they send me any more or not, I don't know. Uh, that was the last contact I had off them was. May the 9th so and obviously they may not have these ones I've requested in yet but yeah I'm waiting for some uh, juice from them uh, good company Vapor Z uh, they do they, they, their pricing is uh, not the lowest and not, not, not the dearest but they are a good company uh, so yeah, I'm waiting for stuff from them. Uh, another drink. So we'll go back. We'll get back to the the mega. I'm a vape. Uh. Yeah, back to the Mega. I've been using this obviously since the review, and it's always been on my samovar. That's all I've used really. Uh, for me personally, I think they they have a quality control issue with the new heads that come with the Mega. I didn't have much luck with them at all. I mean, I've used sorry, excuse me, I've used both the heads already, and uh, they just gurgle on me, gurgling away, letting in too far too much juice. Uh, both of them done the same uh, Ash at my EPAC said he was going to send me some more when he gets the heads in but that was that was uh, last week that was uh, when they when they come out because I, I informed him the first day I had it that one of the heads wasn't good and then put the second head in I did the review for it with the second head and then that went within 24 hours so no they're not very good at all the ones I've got in my box so I'm hopeful, hopefully, Ash at my EPAC is going to send me two, two, two more to replace these because, you know, the, or send me two Pro Tank 3 heads, Pro Tank Mini 3 heads, Aero Tank heads, because they fit in the Mega Tank at the moment. So, what I've done is I've uh, ditched the, the, the new style Kanga heads that come with the Mega. Uh, I've got a few Kanga Pro Tank 3s, these, these heads here. Oops. These are the dual coil uh, Aero Tank or Mini Pro Tank 3 heads. Um, I ripped one of them apart and micro coiled it. That's what I've got in here now. So I've got 1.4 micro coil with cotton wick through it. 
and then another little layer flavour wick on top of it, little tiny bit of cotton on top of it as well, uh, just to show, just to uh, push out because you got you get you get with it being a dual coil, the the head is uh, you've got more gap where the wicks go through, so I've put another bit of cotton on top of the wick as well, and it's it's working fine. It's a nice flavour actually. Lovely. I've used a 28 gauge cancel, seven wraps around one of these type screwdrivers that you get with the K-Fun clones and that. I don't know what diameter they are, a couple of mil, 1.5 mil, something like that. Uh, but it's working a treat in this. Uh, the tank itself is, I think, is very good. Uh, I did put a uh, I did answer a question to somebody the other day on the forum with regards to it being a, a Nautilus killer, but mm, it's not really. Uh, bad choice of words, I think, really. Uh, it's uh, it's up there with the Nautilus, though, uh, because you, the package that you get, you know, it, 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 as you've seen on the review, it's great. Uh, you can either have the stainless or the glass tank attached, but the heads, for me, are a problem at the moment. Uh, I do think they have a problem with quality control of them heads. Uh, just stick a if you know if you're starting getting giggling problems and stuff like that. I believe there's too many holes in the there's four holes in the heads, which was what the Aspire heads had when they had a problem with their heads. They had four holes, albeit their four holes were uh, opposite each other. The, the Kangas heads four holes are opposite each other, or they are opposite each other. But you've got two on one side and two on the other. Uh, but I, I just think the, I've using the 50-50 juice as well and it's still letting in far too much juice so yeah there's a problem I think there with quality control of them heads but it wouldn't put me off buying it because I've just buy uh, personally I wouldn't buy the Kanga, the new star Kanga heads at the moment I'd go with the Aerotank heads the old Aerotank or the Mini Pro Tank 3 heads just buy them put them in because they work just as good if not better and you've you've got no problems with plus you can rebuild them. You can't I haven't say uh, I can't get them new ones apart. I've tried uh, with a pair of pliers and stuff. It's like a, a sealed type unit. Unless someone has, you message me if you have. I, the what the two I've got I can't get apart. Uh, I'd have to cut it with a pair of tin snips or something to get it apart. But yeah, I think there's a bit of a quality control problem with them. So hey ho. Uh, nothing else to say really guys uh, I'll have a quick drink I want to thank all the people who uh, subscribed to my YouTube channel lately as well again uh, superb I mean I've got a, coming up to nearly 100 now subscribers uh, for me that's great because you know I, I'm just a reviewer that reviews stuff that I purchase uh, I, I don't do reviews every week because I don't purchase stuff every week I just try if I review it I'm just trying to help other vapors out with purchasing uh, if I you know obviously with the Kanga Mega especially that was new I'd had it within a couple of days of it coming out so I thought I'll get put a review on that uh, I haven't reviewed, I mean I had the Semivar not so long back off here, let me see who's off, uh, PMs, who was that off, Steve, super member, Yorkshire, we did a trade, I traded a Mar Pravari, and he had, and I had a Semivar, we're both happy with the trade, and I've been, I've been well happy with the Samovar, and he's PM me saying he's he's really happy with this with the Pavari. Uh, but I haven't done a review on this because uh, better people have done reviews on this. Phil Basado did a review of it, and I think Todd's done a review of it as well. People who can test it out properly. Uh, but for, for me, it's been working fine. Uh, I like this over a lot of the other variable voltage mods as well because it's uh, it's got an adjustable top center pin in there it works a little bit like a mechanical at the, the top section 
but yeah, it's been fine for me. And that's why I haven't really done a review on that. Uh, so yeah, thanks Steve for that trade. That was uh, that was in April now. Yeah, how time go? A couple of weeks ago, three weeks ago. Yeah, three weeks ago now. What do you How time flies. Uh, so yeah, I'm just waiting for the TOBH to come and then the Stingray. I'll get their videos up sometime next week because they'll both be here next week, I would say. Uh, the TOBH will be here Monday or Tuesday. And then the Stingray will be, will be here with him because he's local. I'll probably pick it up off him. Uh, off uh, John at One Stop Mod Shop. But thanks again all for watching. Uh, yeah, the subscriber thing, yeah, that's brilliant, that is. I mean, I only do these reviews, like I said, for helping other people out from stuff I purchased. I don't review, uh, I haven't got a weekly review, you know, I don't do something every week. But uh, the comments have been getting back on my YouTube channel. Uh, thumbs up to Roscoe as well, another reviewer off the forum. Uh, does reviews for UK, he said, Cabin, Tony. Uh, He's a bit more professional than I am, actually. He's getting a bit big for his boots. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, Roscoe, great stuff, mate. Carry on with the good work. Uh, but, yeah, I just review stuff I purchased. Uh, I have had a couple of things sent me from vendors uh, in the past, but I don't, get, I don't get them on a regular basis at all. I've got, like I said, I've got them few juices coming from Vapor Sea, which I haven't paid for, which they wanted me to review for them. Uh, apart from that, I just like to help other vapors out with purchases really and sh try to show them before they purchase anything. Uh, well, thanks again for watching, guys. And uh, it's, it's at 16 17 minutes so far. That's about you know, I've got nothing else to say. I'll be rambling, I'm rambling now actually. So, uh, have a great week, uh, guys and girls, and I'll see you in the next uh, review video. Thank you very much. Bye.